hello guys welcome back again to my channel today i'm going to be showing you how to cut a perfect straight line using your jigsaw so this is how any other person would cut and let's see whether it will be straight enough so one way of checking whether it's straight enough is just by uh, looking using the uh, the naked eye and I have some bumps and valleys around there and to clearly illustrate just take a ruler a straight ruler and on the edge just check to see if there are any spaces and this one as you can see we have some spaces in that wood and even just at the start we have a big gap so now i'm going to show you how you can cut a completely straight line make sure your jigsaw is off because we are going to be taking some measurements and then again we are going to start by taking measurements on where we are going to be cutting normally when you're cutting wood with a jigsaw the blade will cut through the line and so um, we need to take the measurement of from where the blade is to where this uh, to where this piece of metal ends to that edge so that we get to know the distance between that and that and then we are going to get uh, a piece of straight bar and clamp it there so that it it acts as our guideline so that we cut that straight uh, line as perfectly as possible so guys let me just repeat and bring it closer um, so since we are cutting the line through here and this is the end of uh, this metal bar this base plate we are going to take the measurement from this from this end of the blade to that end of that plate so to achieve that you can use a ruler and place it there and just get to know exactly where um, that gap measures so this is 3.1 and alternatively you can also measure using uh, vernier calipers and as you can see even that measures 3.1 Okay, so we're going to go on to the next step. The next step, obviously, is translating that measurement onto our wood. So if you found that it's 3.1, we're going to measure from that line and make a mark on the left side at 3.1. On this, on, on this part of the wood and also on this other side, this other end. So, all right, so once you've done that, remember we've done the straight line, which we've connected with the ruler, and then we've measured the gap between the blade and the end of the base plate, which is 3.1, and we've made a mark on that end and on this end. The next step is to find a bar that has one end that is very, um, straight almost perfectly straight and for you to determine that just find a ruler like this place it on that end and just make sure that there is no gap anywhere as you can see it's perfectly straight and of course after you found uh, the measurement of the gap you can um, uh, you can indicate it on your uh, bar your guide bar so that you always remember and it always becomes an easy task for you to do so that you don't have to always remeasure okay again uh, once you've done that uh, we are going to clamp this bar we're going to use a pair of g clamps and place your bar exactly at the point uh, which is 3.1 centimeters left of the line that we want to cut. Make sure that the height of the bar 
corresponds to the allowance that you get with your jigsaw so that it has enough allowance so that is not very long if it's very long then it will be impeded by these other features of your jigsaw just make sure that it's on the line and always uh, power up your jigsaw first and then bring it into contact with your wood never uh, start uh, powering up your saw when it's in contact with the cutting surface that you want to cut otherwise you'll have a kickback so you're done make sure to always power off your jigsaw to avoid any injuries Remember, I'm using the T144D blade, which is perfect for speed while cutting. And while you're cutting straight cuts, you want it to cut very fast. And if you have a jigsaw that can increase speed, make sure you put it on, uh, on high speed. And now let's see whether our cut is straight enough. So again, to test this out, you're going to bring in a flat, a straight side of your ruler place it on that end and just see whether you have any gaps left and guys as you can see that's a perfect line that's a straight line cut with your jigsaw so guys my hope is that you learned something new today about cutting a perfectly straight line with your jigsaw remember to leave a like subscribe and also share with your friends i'll see you in the next video bye bye